timeless collection of songs from Canada's finest vocalists. Make love to me, next Anne shares a decade of her favorite classics from the 50s. Croonin, featuring Cry Me a River, Make Love to Me, Wayward Wind, and many more. I've been wanting to sing these songs ever since I heard them for the first time. When I was a kid listening to this music, I used to sing along to all of them. And I, in the back of my mind, I've always thought of doing an oldies album. I didn't know what shape it would take. Then it kind of hit me one day, why don't you do the songs you cut your teeth on? And these are those songs. Croonin in stores everywhere. There's a lot of little reasons why we chose our appliance store. Mm -hmm. First, because they have the best-selling brand of appliances in Canada. And because they're built to last. And if you ever need service, you get it right from Sears. So there's nothing to worry about. Only everything was back like a Kenmore. Because it's not just what you buy that's important. It's where you buy it's where you buy it. Buy that's it. right. Expect more from Sears. As it happens, it's as it happens. <laughs> they can do something really whimsical. Mr. Larson phoned in about the eight-foot cabbage. And then the next minute, they can do something about you know, genocide that will rip my heart out. What about the violence, though, that we saw over the weekend uh, around the White House? As it happens, you know, can blow your mind. Radio that blows your mind. I'm Barbara Bud. I'm Michael Ed, right? As it happens, radio that tastes like chocolate. <laughs> <laughs> This week, Sierra E. Trudeau, one, two, oh, three. The triumphant early years in politics. Pierre Elliott Trudeau, memoirs, tonight at nine on CBC. A river, a dam, and a government that ignored its own scientists. It was simply a case of government looking after big business first. Tuesday on the Fifth Estate. A capitalist oasis in the heart of China. This is the border between two economic realities within China. An economic haven for the young, the rich, and the ambitious. They've got a lot of money. They've got nowhere to put it. The birth of a new revolution. Give it another 10 years, it will be the largest economy in the world. But with economic freedom comes corruption. CBC's Mark Starovich explores a China that will dominate the next century. Red Capitalism, tonight at 8. Arlen Barch, Marketing Director, Corel Corporation. Marion Marshall, Corporate Office Designer. Harold Lennett, CEO, Pimlico Apparel. There are reasons people read the Financial Post. Get the news with a business perspective and see how it can affect you and your career. Isn't it time you got it? Call today. We'll deliver five days a week before 6 a.m. guaranteed. Subscribe now and get 10 free issues. The Post's tabloid format is quicker to read. You'll get more stocks, more charts, more money-making and saving information. Columnists, including Diane Francis, take on anyone or anything. Check out the Financial Post Top 500, even road test a hot new car. Subscribe now and get a free portfolio. Steve Coles, future president, DM Incorporated. Get the Financial Post, a free portfolio plus 10 free issues. Use your credit card. Call 1-800-565-6024 now. That's 1-800-565-6024. In the race for a better diaper, Huggies has taken a commanding lead over the competition with the revolutionary Ultra Trim Diaper. Its trim design lets a runner move swiftly and easily because it's nearly 50% thinner than ordinary diapers. And Huggies Ultra Trim is incredibly absorbent. 
so it protects against leaks like no diaper ever before. And Huggies Ultra Trim sets a new record for thinness with great leakage protection. Well, we often listen uh, to the world of sex in our kitchen in the country. Bob Oxley and the others come up with uh, very good news stories. And they have a fund of correspondents who are reliable. The World at Six from the National Newsroom. Radio scientists concerned with getting written pictures as television is, so they often have rather more to say about the story and go into it more deeply. This is Brochel, the Irish island. They came to Canada in the coffin ship. This was the worst thing that ever happened to my mind in Canadian history. Refugees from the Irish potato famine. The first ship, the Virginius, when it arrived at Grosseil, had 170 people dead on board. Thousands laid to rest in the mass graves of this island in the St. Lawrence. We're going to celebrate these deaths? Doesn't make sense. Hunger's Children, Monday at 10 on Witness. And now, the news. And here are the job opportunities from Employment Canada. None! <laughs> and the weather. There is an L shape over in the Maritimes. This hour has 22 minutes, Monday at 11. What a week. Parliament's in business again, and so are we. The Royal Canadian Air Force, where we don't take anything seriously. We're back this week. The Royal Canadian Air Force on CBC, Friday at 7.30 on Living Television. You don't want us in the fur business. Jobs or animal rights. That tape misrepresents what we're doing here. And the town is in uproar. His furs have nothing to do with the Lynx River Project. Misguided loyalty on North of 60, Thursday at 8. I'm a good cop. I don't care what anybody says. Laura takes Rob's cousin on as a client. You don't like prostitutes, do you? It's not an open and shut case. And... You're coming here is not a good idea. Is Olivia's client too close for comfort? Street Legal, 8 p.m. Friday. Up here, there are two things that can take your breath away. The scenery and a cold, like the one I've got right now. That's why I depend on something my doctor recommended. Dimetap Extend Tabs. For my nasal congestion and runny nose, I take one in the morning and I breathe easier all day. So when you can't be bothered by a cold, remember to take Dimetap Extend Tabs and give yourself some breathing space. Newcraft Light Peanut Butter. I sense disappointment. Another light product the world can't live without. I mean, sure, I'm cutting back on fat, but light peanut butter is nothing sacred. And I'm supposed to believe this will taste as good as regular Kraft peanut butter? No way. There's some pop you know, there are exceptions to every rule. <laughs> it tastes like regular Kraft peanut butter. I'm surprised. New Kraft Light peanut butter. Tastes beyond belief. The recording event of the decade. Start spreading the news. 13 of Frank Sinatra's timeless classics. Newly recorded and accompanied by the world's greatest no. musical talent. I've got the world on a string. And I've sitting on a rainbow. Chance. Frank Sinatra, duet. Take one. What's great about Peter? Good morning, I'm Peter Zosky. This is Morningside. He's prepared for anybody that is coming into the studio, and he can carry on a conversation with you like you've been talking regularly for two or three years. The bastard's a Victorian? Whoops, that's a long question. He just really, uh, really puts you at ease.
the magical world of Disney on CBC, and you could win one of four trips to beautiful Disneyland in Southern California. Visit all your favorite attractions, plus an all-new land, Mickey's Toontown. You'll fly Delta Airlines, the official airline of Disneyland, and stay at the Disneyland Hotel. Tonight, tune in to Disney's Night of Magic and identify one of the musical guests or magicians. Write your answer on a postcard or entry form in this week's TV Guide and send it to this address. Tonight, Hetty's on a mission. I bought the camera. All she needs is a little luck and a lot of help. Perfect. Road to Avonlea, tonight at 7 on CBC. The Odyssey. An incredible journey through the subconscious to a strange, dreamlike place run by kids. Hey, are you here? The season premiere of The Odyssey, January 24th on CBC.